Welcome to the new video. I'm Divyanshu and I'm an indie hacker. I quit my job last year and this is my second year building my own projects, monetizing them and earning revenue. In this video, I'm going to show you the desk which I recently set up properly and what do I put on my desk? This was one of the video which was asked in my live streams a lot. So yeah, here we go. Let's see what do I have on my desk. So this is kind of a desk tour video. So yeah, let's start. <music> So it's been almost one year since I moved to Goa. I have added all these things which helped me develop my like software development journey as an indie hacker and also build my YouTube channel. I recently changed my desk which was gifted to me by Sam. I really love the aesthetic of it. It's an standing desk. I can manually crank it up but usually I don't work while standing. The design and finish of the tabletop, I just love it. So this minion, this was gifted to me by my wife. This is kind of my bug hunter. I talk to it about bugs and we fix it together. Now talking about the brain of this whole desk, that is my Mac Studio. This is a M2 Max with 32 gigs of RAM. I use a lot of accessories with this Mac Studio. And one of the thing which helped me manage all my YouTube is this SSD. This is a one terabyte SSD. All my media goes into it. Now to accompany this Mac Studio, I also was gifted this chill guy, which hangs right there, chilling. So I really like the aesthetic of LED and RGBs around my setup. It gives like a bit of a techie vibe. So I have this keyboard mat, which I use. For the monitors, I use LG monitors here. This is a 27 inch LG widescreen. So I've been using LG monitors for a long time and they have never disappointed me. The another monitor, which I got secondhand in Goa is the LG 24 inch 4K. And to accompany is, is my ambient monitor light. One of the best investment which I made for my comfort was this leg cushion. It helps you a lot when you're working for more than eight hours. So no desk is complete without a music system. I was using a Marshall's small speaker earlier because it was very portable. I could carry it in my backpack. Since it's not working for last six months, I wanted something cheap and portable. So I moved to the boat. The sound quality, I'm not a big fan of, but it does its work and keeps the vibe of the room. For all my audio recordings, even this audio which I'm recording, I use this Sennheiser Profile mic. This performs really well and the price is not so expensive and it comes with a mount as well. So while we are talking about the audio recording, the number one video recording device which I use on my desk is this Osmo Pocket 3. This is one of the best purchases for me in the year 2024. And this is the device which I always use for most of my wide screen recordings. Now the most important gadget for any developer, the keyboard. I'm currently using Logi MX keys and I really love this keyboard. The aesthetic of it, the battery life and the sound and the feedback it provides to me while typing on it. So for the mouse, I'm currently using the Logitech's MX Master 3S. I got this mouse as soon as it was released. I really like the ergonomics of it. It keeps my wrist in a very right position so I do not feel any pain and I can work for a very long time using this mouse. So this is my go-to mouse whenever I need. Now I want to talk about a couple of 3D items which I have on my desk which I created using my 3D printer. This specs holder but I'm currently using it to hold my screwdriver. I really like it in front of me giving me this screwdriver to me. Another 3D item which I'm really proud of printing is this old Macintosh. This is an Apple Macintosh in a form of an iWatch charger. So the watch charger is behind the Macintosh and I can just put my watch and it looks so neat with this screen. Another 3D printed piece is this headphone mount, which I also 3D printed. It's like a mechanical screw. Currently, it's not looking so great. It's uh, broken, so I want to print it again. Now talking about other small accessories on my desk, I have this ultra human ring, which I only use to track my sleep. I do not wear it any other time. I just track my sleep from it. They have a very nice app, which shows me how much I slept and how good the quality of my sleep is. 
so it's usually charges on my desk i always keep a book in front in my desk so whenever i feel like i can read a page currently i am reading this book called difficult conversations and this is mostly about how to discuss what matters the most it improves overall conversation skills another new member on my desk is this miniature bhagavad gita this was gifted to me by my brother it now sits on my desk reminding me of the values and wisdom it holds and now finally another new gadget which i recently got and i haven't got chance to set it up this is a steam deck neo so this i got to upgrade my live stream setup so that i can move from one transition to another and i can do these workflows better let's see how does it goes but so far looking very nice and cute on my desk cool so i hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please uh, do subscribe and like and i really like when you guys comment i reply to almost all the comments here i make similar kind of videos so yeah i'll see you in the next one bye bye